Turning to North Korea, South Korea's Joint Chiefs of Staff said Nor North Korea fired two projectiles, possibly ballistic missiles, into the East Sea this morning. This is the fourth time this month that the regime has launched some sort of projectile. Our defense correspondent, Bae eun reports. South Korea's military says the North launched two projectiles that appear to be short-range ballistic missiles. The Joint Chiefs of Staff said in a text message to reporters that the projectiles were fired eastward from Sunan Airport in Pyongyang City. The military said it is closely monitoring the situation to be ready for any additional launches by the North. The Defense Ministry says South Korea and U.S. intelligence agencies are analyzing the latest move. This is the fourth launch this month, taking place just three days after the North fired the same type of missiles last Friday. The North reported that they were ballistic missiles launched from a train, marking the North's second known launch using a railway platform, following the first one last September. Seoul's military said its initial assessment showed that last Friday's missiles flew about 430 kilometers, at a maximum altitude of 36 kilometers. The North also launched missiles last Tuesday and on January 5th, and claimed that both of those launches were successful tests of its hypersonic missiles. Hypersonic missiles are seen as a game-changer because they are easier to maneuver and operate at high speeds, meaning they are harder to track and intercept. Last Tuesday's launch was conducted under the watch of its leader Kim Jong-un. Pyongyang is banned from developing or testing ballistic missiles and nuclear weapons under multiple UN Security Council resolutions. Pae Eun-ji, Arirang News.